Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Moshe bringing you guys another video. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys some more tips and tricks on how you can get more victory royales in solos, in squads, in duos, anything like that. This tip is actually a pro tip that Tfue ended up showing people, but he never really showed how to do it. He just showed you how it's done. He never gave you like tips and tricks on like breaking it down on how to learn it and stuff like that. I actually learned it in less than 30 minutes on PC, and then I was like, you know what? Let me give it a try on console. So then I ended up learning it on console as well. So guys, stay tuned. If you're on console, don't worry. You can do it on console. I'm going to show you guys the tips and tricks and techniques on how to do it on console. It is a little bit different than PC. It is a little bit more difficult, but it still can be done. So I don't care if anyone out there is like, yo, PC has an advantage that they can build a little, uh, do things crazier on PC that people can't do on console. This is not true. Console people can keep up with PC people. Don't don't sleep on them. So guys, stay tuned. I'll show you guys that. But basically, what we're going to have to do is go to Wailing Woods, get as much wood as we possibly can because we're going to be showing you guys this tutorial. It sucks that playground mode isn't out because like before, this is where I actually learned how to do it. It was in playground mode. I, I spent one game doing it on PC and console, and it took me 30 minutes to learn. And it was very, very easy to do because you could just farm trees, hit like three trees, and you have 999 wood and then nobody's there to bother you nobody's there to shoot you or anything like that so you can go all the way up to the sky so guys if you do want to learn this stay tuned maybe for uh when playground mode comes out when playground mode comes out that's the best time to practice if you do it in a public match i just want to warn you now people are going to shoot at you people are going to be dickheads they're going to try to shoot you down so you can't go up all the way to the sky and stuff like that but it is still fun to practice so again practice makes perfect but i'll show you guys the best tips and tricks so first I'm going to get 999 wood and then I'm going to come back and show you guys how it looks and then how it's done. Alright you guys, so now that we basically have a 999 wood, let me finish that last tree. We have all this open space. It sucks because, look at this, the circle's all the way over here so I'm not going to have to be able to do it all in this one game. So I'm going to have to find another match and stuff like that. And that's what sucks about not having playground mode out yet. But so basically, this is what it's going to look like you guys. When you ramp rush somebody, oh my goodness, I'm already choking it. When you ramp rush somebody, it's going to look like this. And yes, you can mess up a few times, but it's easy to correct it just like that, you guys. So that's what it's going to basically look like. Again, this took me 30 minutes to do. Guys, it's my first game on, so give me a second to warm up. But I'll show you guys exactly how it's done. I can usually do a first try very easy, but again, like I said, this is my first game on. But look at how many mats i just gone through just to show you guys what it's supposed to look like. So this, don't mind these right there. That's kind of a little mess up and stuff like that. Actually, you know what? You know what? Let me, let me restart. Let me show you guys how it's actually done. I don't want to show you guys the improper way. I don't want to show you guys anything bad so let me let me just restart this all right, all right, all right, now we have enough wood. Let's show you guys exactly what it's supposed to look like and how it's done. Now, don't mind that mess up that I did earlier. Again, I am just, I just woke up. I'm just getting on, so I'm learning how to do it again. But this is what it's going to basically look like, you guys. Just like that. Now, again, you don't want to go up too high whenever you're doing it to actually somebody. Um, you're not going to be going all the way to the sky like I did over there. You're just going to go up probably three to four to five layers high. But, again, this is what it's supposed to look like, you guys. Uh, there's some mess-ups here and there. But, again, you're not supposed to be going that high. Now, the reason this is probably the most effective thing to do is because, guys, look at this. Let me show you guys real quick what it's going to look like for the enemy. So, say I'm the enemy right here. I'm going to have to get through... Not one, I'm gonna have to get through this layer right here to shoot somebody down basically. So when I'm ramp rushing somebody, I gotta get through two layers and three layers of shooting just to knock these stairs down, just to knock this person down. So if you're doing just a normal ramp rush or something like that and you're rushing somebody and, and you're just doing something like this, it's gonna be very easy for them to knock you down because look at this, all they have to do is get rid of one layer. All they gotta do is shoot down this thing right here and then once they shoot this down, the whole thing goes tumbling down, so you end up going down very quick. Now, this is just as fast and effective as that right there. It does use up a little bit more mass, but I'll show you guys how to do it. As you can see, the storm's coming through the woods right now. I'm going to end up dying, so I can't do anything about that. But I'll show you guys how it's done, basically, coming up right now. Again, sometimes you can mess up. Oh, I'm out of mats. But I'll show you guys how to do it perfectly on both PC and console. So I'll see you guys 
once we find another match. All right, you guys, I'm back. Luckily, the circle, as you can see, is here closer to me, so I can show you guys a little bit more. But I'm going to show you guys how I learned it in just 30 minutes. So first off, first step you want to do again, of course, is just a normal ramp rush. So this is a normal ramp rush. This is what it looks like right here. Uh, very simple, very easy. Once you get this down, this is step one. If you can't do that, practice that. The next step is the ramps and wall. It looks like this, you guys. Now again, if you can't do this, keep practicing that. You're gonna wanna take steps on learning this. If you guys can do this, don't worry. Skip these steps right here. This is for more of the beginner people. Learn this right here. And then after you guys can do this, the reason this is super effective is because it takes one, two, you gotta shoot through both of those layers just to knock the person down instead of one layer. So it makes it a little bit harder for the enemy to knock you down, but again, it is not the most effective way. So as you guys can see right there, those are the first two steps. If you know how to do those, you're already basically halfway there. You're almost all ready to be able to do it on your own. So after you can do that, you wanna practice on doing this, that, and that. It's basically what it looks like is a stairs, floor wall stairs floor wall stairs floor wall stairs floor wall stairs floor wall and that's what it's gonna look like right there once you look at this guy look at look at this dude look at, look at this dude bro i'm trying to show my people oh great this guy's a try hard and i only have a first too which is the worst part Come on, look at this scar. He had a scar. He had, oh my god, he had such good loot and he couldn't kill me? What do you, what do you mean? <coughs> my voice almost cracked right there. Alright, back to the tutorial. Ooh, he gave me 999 wood, which is really good. Actually, let's not even destroy that stuff. Let's just come over here. Okay, so once you're able to do that, um, the next step you want to be able to do is basically this right here. So you're going to want to start working on this. And this is basically what it looks like, you guys, without the wall. This is the next step. Just walk up the ramp and work on this. Now, there's a specific order that you want to do this in. Um, now, again, pay attention to the order because if you do it any other order, it's going to be wrong. Now, the only thing we're missing, again, is, of course, this right here. Is that right there? So we're just missing that. Uh, that's the next step. Don't worry about that yet. So if basically what you want to do is this order right here. You want to look down at like a 45 degree angle. It's not like a 90 degree angle. I think it's a 45 degree angle on PC. And you want to be able to put your stairs as you come up to this point right here. Now as you're right here, you're looking down at an angle. You want to put your stairs, floorboard, stairs. Stairs, floorboard, stairs. Stairs, floorboard, stairs. Now, while you're doing this, you're holding, you're spamming the button. To, you're not even spamming it. You're just holding it down. The button that pushes to place your things down like that, you're, you're holding it down constantly. So, like, when you're building a one-by-one one and you have turbo building on and you're doing this, uh, you're just spamming it and holding it down as much as possible. You're not, you're not clicking it every few seconds. You're just holding it down with one continuous hold, and that's what's allowing you to turbo build and make it done a lot quicker. So once you're doing that, first thing again, what you want to do is do it walking. Never start sprinting because, again, it's very hard to do sprinting. Sprinting is the last step that you want to do. Um, first thing, the storm's coming, so we got to get some more wood, get to the circle, and then I'll show you guys the last few steps on how to do it. Now, again, on console, it is a little bit different on console, but don't worry. It's just the angle that you look at. Everything else is pretty much the same, so stay tuned for that coming out very very shortly the storm is closing in on our butt cheeks boys we gotta get out of here once you have those steps down right there you guys again you want to do this with walking it is a lot easier doing it while walking rather than sprinting so first thing you want to do put down your stairs put down your wall and then go go at this uh, about a 45 degree angle go stairs holding down your your placement button floor stairs and constantly do this constantly just keep doing this Again, this is the combination that you want to do it in. If you fall, just jump up and do it again. And just keep going up all the way to the top as far as you can. You might get shot down, but in playground mode, you don't have to worry about that. So don't even stress it. Um, playground mode is going to be coming out probably in the next week or two. So don't don't even stress it, you guys. But that's basically step one. Now, it already looks very, very good. The only thing we're missing is the wall. So once we get that down, we're going to try to do it while sprinting. So once you get this down, try sprinting and doing it. It's a little bit harder, but it's actually pretty easy. As long as you have turbo building on, it's fairly, fairly easy, you guys. So I promise you, turn put turbo building on, and you guys are going to be able to knock this out very easy. So once you get that down, next step again, of course, is the final step on how it's done. So you want to be able to do that while walking, and you want to add the wall to it. So it's going to look like this. Now, again, you can, you can uh, stop. If you can't do it, just stop and then do it. 
stop. Oh, sometimes you'll mess up, though. That's the thing about stopping, is it can mess you up. And then you could do it like that. But again, once you stop walking like that, it, it does help out because when you're, of course, learning something, you want to take baby steps. You don't want to just jump right into it because then it's going to discourage you and make you feel like you can't do it and stuff like that. I can't believe someone really took all these wooden pallets here. Wow, I was going to use these wooden pallets for the tutorial. But that's all you have to do. Once you have that down just by walking, you're ready to do it sprinting. Just keep practicing that, keep practicing that. Try it with sprinting. If you can't do it yet, learn how to master it just by walking. And then that's the, basically the almost the last step. Once you learn how to do it walking, you're ready to do it while sprinting, and it's gonna make things a little bit easier. So once you have that done, you guys, go ahead and do it while sprinting. And this is what it's gonna look like while sprinting. Again, you have to have turbo, oh, I have no mats, dude. It's so hard to show you guys the tutorial when I run out of mats. This is why playground mode needs to be out soon. But it is very effective, you guys. I promise you, it's going to help you out in the long run uh, whenever you're ramp rushing somebody that actually just sits back and shoots at you. That's probably the best way to do it. If somebody's ramp rushing you back, there's no point in doing that just because you guys are going to, uh, you're just going to end up wasting mats because you guys are going to end up meeting each other up and it's going to be a build battle rather than him just trying to shoot you down. But if somebody's sitting in a one by one base or something like that and they're playing like very scared and you want to rush them, that is the best technique for you guys. I think this tree is probably one hit, but I do need wood yeah see someone oh man someone's out here running around farming taking all my wood oh, there's nowhere i don't see any other trees to hit if we get in a gunfight we have no mass to protect ourselves this is not looking good at all you guys oh we could go to dusty divot dusty has a whole bunch of trees i forgot the only thing is is getting to dusty without being seen by anyone else okay so we're just gonna get mad for now so that way if we do run into somebody we at least have a little bit of mass to protect ourselves and try to win that gunfight we're on pc so sometimes you're either gonna run into a complete freaking bot or you're gonna run into a super try hard that's all it is on pc you're either really really good on pc or you're just a bot so it, it, you really got to look out for that there's no in-betweens um it's just a 50 50 draw it looks like no one's here so we got all this wood to farm and then i can show you guys how it is done and the circle is completely in whaling or dusty divot so people are going to be coming here extremely fast oh my goodness this tree was one shot oh my goodness somebody is out here farming look at this Every tree. Okay, good. Not this tree. Every tree with one hit. People are out here farming, trying to take my wood. This is what makes tutorial videos difficult because yesterday I was trying to do this video for you guys. I got so stressed out because people were shooting me down, killing me. I was trying to do a tutorial that I just gave up on it. I spent a few hours doing it and people were just annoying me so much. I was like, dude, I can't do this anymore. I'm, I'm done. I'm done with it. But like I said, once you get it down with walking, the next step is sprinting. And the sprinting part is just as easy as walking. Again, it is a little bit more difficult. Um, there's baby steps to it. There's levels to it. Uh, like Drake says, you got to be able to do the first steps first. And then you can move on to the next one. If you guys are able to do this, let me know down in the comment section below who can do this. Because if you can, this means you're probably one of the top tier builders in the game. Because it is not a easy task to do. If, if you guys want me to give it a level of how difficult it is between uh, intermediate, beginner, uh, medium, hard, pro. I would probably say it's at a hard level because I'm not a pro. There's no way I'm a pro at this game, but I can still do it, which means it's definitely up there as one of the harder things to do. But with you having turbo building on, it makes it a lot easier because you don't have to click every time you switch to your different maps and stuff like that. You just you just have to just hold down the button. So again, this is what it looks like, you guys. And it's going to give you the advantage on the other person because they have to get through one layer two layers which is the wall and three layers which is the other set of stairs now i don't know what the flat platform is for i guess just in case if you're at an angle like say this angle right here they have to get through that and then the and then the floorboard and then the stairs so it depends on angles but if somebody's straight on they're not really going to be worried about the, the stairs and stuff like that but we're not worried about that guys there's only four people left i don't know if we can win this game i'm gonna try again i'm kind of a noob on pc i'm still learning the ropes and stuff like that so we're gonna definitely try but we're probably gonna run into a sweater because it is top five situation we only have one kill so it's like barely in the circle so usually people like to camp out when things are yes yeah, so, someone's in here Okay, so they dipped out. Oh, no, no, no.
Oh, he's got to reload his guns. Oh, no, he's not healing up on my watch. Oh, my God, just spray. That's all that gun is, dude. All, all those guns are is just spraying. Okay, I let you guys down this dude. 21 HP. Even if I kill them, this dude from behind was going to kill me. I, oh, I'm stressed. I'm stressed. All right, let's go to PS4. So as you guys can see, we're on console now. This is a pre-recorded game. You guys can probably tell. If not, this was in the playground game mode. So as you can see, this one tree gives us like a thousand what? Look at how much wood we're getting. A thousand one hundred and seventy wood off of one tree. This is why we all love playground mode because you can actually practice stuff like that. So again, stay tuned, you guys. But this is my first try ever trying to do it. As you guys can see on console, I'm trying to see... If I can just do step number three, I believe it is, which is just the ramp, the floorboard, and the wall alone. Now, the reason I'm trying to see if I could do this, I know you, I could do this normally, but I have to look down and then up. Like, I have to move my right joystick while doing this, and that's really hard on console to do that and multitask at the same time. So, I was trying to see if I can do it without having to look up and down and just hit it at the right angle where I can hit everything on my own. But you guys are going to see that I actually end up failing. It's not possible. I have to literally look up and down. So, I'm like, you know what? Maybe it's impossible. Let me try to do it the normal way. But as you guys can see, I'm just going to start off by walking, trying it out slowly, taking it step by step, doing it by the exact steps that I did on PC where I do the, the stairs, the floorboard, the stairs, then the wall. You guys are going to see me mess up a little bit. This is my first try ever. If you guys look at the timer, there's only 53 minutes on the timer in playground mode because I'm trying it for my first time, trying to walk it out and see if I can do it. I know that the angle that I'm doing at is a little bit different because on console, I can't just do it at this 45 degree angle right here that you see me doing it at right now i learned that you can't just do it like that like on pc you could do it but on console you can't do it at an angle like this because you end up setting it up wrong like how you see me doing it right here you guys are going to see me exactly do it perfectly in this next clip coming up but i just want you guys to see the learning process of it because i don't get it right away i think i hit a max height limit right there so we're going to go into the next clip right here as you can see look at how many times i've practiced it there's one two three four there's like six of these all over the map all over the place because all you see is me doing it jumping to my death farming like three trees getting nine nine wood and then practicing it again so right Right here this is where you're going to see me actually do it on a full off not sprint but just walking non-stop walking you're going to be able to see me do it and i'm looking up at an angle and that's because i can hit the bottom one and the top one all in simultaneously like i literally do it in one go so that way i don't have to switch back so basically on console it's going to be a little bit different instead of doing the combination of ramp floorboard ramp wall i'm doing ramp ramp floor wall ramp ramp floor wall ramp ramp floor wall and that's the best way to do it you have to hit it at this exact angle that i'm looking at right now it's like looking a little bit up kind of straight but a little bit up it's going to be a little bit difficult see the problem that i ran into is when i started sprinting i started putting the floorboard above my head so you got to literally do this extremely quick this is the best route to do it it's still it still can be done you guys i am doing it on console as you can see like it, it, it's a little bit more challenging but it can be done and it is possible so for those of you guys out there that are hating right here perfect i'm hitting it many times i just ran out of mats but you guys can see i did it right there but there you guys have it that's how you guys do it on console and pc i hope these tips and tricks helped out but thank you guys for watching so much appreciate it more than anything if you guys please can give this video a thumbs up and i'll see you guys in the next video peace